Today we're looking at expression of ideas, practice tests for the writing and language section, only those questions that count for the subscore expression of ideas, and we cut out a few of the really long ones. Number two, he painted the murals first two sections, featuring images of a tropical rainforest and a Maya pyramid during the day. Also, to avoid scrutiny, Suqueros painted the final section of the mural, the centerpiece, at night. To show this contrast between the two sentences, painting during the day and painting at night, however, is the best transition word. Number five. The reason for Suquero's secrecy became clear when the mural was confided. So, a mural cannot be confided. But if we choose D, unveiled, that is an action that can be performed on physical objects like murals. Number eight, which choice most effectively combines the underlined sentences? The result was an explosion of mural painting that spread throughout California and the southwestern United States in the 1970s. It was the Chicano mural movement. B is the best choice because this comma here correctly places and punctuates the A positive phrase. Everything after this describes the Chicano mural movement. 14. Some people buy organic food because they believe organically grown crops are more nutritious and safer for consumption than the people who purchase their conventionally grown counterparts, which are usually produced with pesticides and synthetic fertilizers. In the name of health, spending $1.60 for every dollar they would have spent on food that is grown in a manner that is considered conventional. D. Conventionally grown is the best choice because it efficiently creates a contrast with organically grown. Notice the L-Y, organically, versus conventionally. Referring back to the earlier part of the paragraph. Number 15. In the name of health, spending a dollar sixty for every dollar they would have spent on food that is grown in the manner that is considered conventional. Scientific evidence, therefore, suggests that consumers do not reap significant benefits in terms of either nutritional value or safety from organic food. C, however, is the best answer because it sets up the contrast between the added expense of organic food and the evidence that suggests a lack of benefits from eating organic food. Number 16. It should be maintain, although advocates of organic food maintain that organic produce is healthier than conventionally grown produce because it has more vitamins and minerals. This assertion is not supported by scientific research. Maintain is commonly used to describe advocating a position in an argument. 17. Although advocates of organic food pre preserve that organic produce is healthier than conventionally grown produce because it has more vitamins and minerals, this assertion is not supported by scientific research. This assertion not being supported. For instance, choice A is the best uh, answer, no change. One review published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition provided analysis of the results of comparative studies conducted over a span of 50 years. Researchers consistently found no evidence that organic crops are more nutritious than conventionally grown ones in terms of their vitamin and mineral content. So the transitional phrase, for instance, sets up an example supporting the point made in the previous sentence that organic food may not contain more vitamins and minerals than conventionally grown food. Number 23. The writer wants to convey an attitude of genuine interest and to avoid the appearance of mockery. Which choice best accomplishes this goal? Research on regional variations in English language use has not only yielded answers to such life-altering questions as how people in different parts of the United States refer to carbonated beverages, it also illustrates how technology can change the very nature of research. So what you call soda is certainly not life-altering. If you say it's weird, you're probably mocking a little bit as well. If you want to have genuine interest, C, intriguing, would make the most sense. It conveys a realistic level of interest for the entertaining, but ultimately inconsequential question of regional differences in words for carbonated beverages. 25. Which choice most effectively sets up the contrast in the sentence and is consistent with the information in the rest of the passage? B, still has an important place because it is consistent with the fact that there remains a veritable army of trained volunteers traveling the country, and because it uses still to contrast this method with the new avenues. Number 26. 
Though weight did not dampen enthusiasm among scholars, scholars consider the work a signal achievement in linguistics. So the repetition of the word scholars is redundant, and we don't need it. And you notice the same thing happens in B, the same thing happens in C. D is the only one who uses a pronoun to replace scholars, or which uses a pronoun to re replace scholars, avoiding the redundancy. 31. The writer wants the information in the passage to correspond as closely as possible with the information in the map. Given that goal, and assuming that the rest of the previous sentence would remain unchanged, in which sequence should the three terms for soft drinks be discussed? We see pop here in the middle and western portions should come first where there's soda, so we can rule out D and A. And next up, they're talking about southern states, so that's Coke. So Coke should be next which gives us our answer, C. Number 39. A designer must generate extensive documentation and explain his or her ideas clearly in order to ensure that the programmers, artists, and others on the team all share the same vision. C, consequently, is the best answer. Anyone considering a career as a video game designer must be skilled writers and speakers. The importance of communication is established in the previous sentence. The transition, consequently, best captures the fact that the designer must be skilled in this area. 41. In fact, many designers initially begin their pursuits as programmers. Initially and begin are redundant. They both mean the same thing, to start. Same way, start and begin, or initiate and progression. D is the only choice here that avoids redundancy. 42. Courses in psychology and human behavior may help you develop emphatic collaboration skills, while courses in the humanities, such as in literature and film, should give you the background necessary to develop effective narrative structures. 42. The best answer is D. Important, because it logically and appropriately modifies the phrase collaboration skills. Choices A, B, and C are incorrect because none appropriately describes the value of collaboration skills.